How can I forget you, girl? I miss you in the worst way. Used to have me feeling like a kid on his birthday. How you let me down, you did it in the worst way. I let you take my heart when you had a family. Fighting for what's right is like. All right, we are here and we are live. Welcome to Lose a Room, another episode, followed by my homies, my brothers. <laughs> We got Javon Haiti in the building. We got Johnny Deep. No pun intended. <laughs> no, all pun intended. Oh, and then we got JQ, the poof, 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 DJ. <laughs> what up? What's up, man? Everybody, how y'all doing? <laughs> Freak hoes. Clappers to the front. Uh, yeah, you might have to speak in a little bit closer because it's not. Freak bitches. Hopefully it got you. I don't know if it's picking y'all up. I'm not seeing it catch anything. It's it's catching, but it's just y'all not y'all too far away. I think. I'm not seeing no wave patterns. That shit's scary. No, it's it's on the top. Y'all the top one. Yeah, I noticed. That's so I ain't seeing the wave patterns. That shit looking scary. Yeah, bro. it's there. Obviously, it's just, you gotta lean in there. Yeah, you just gotta have to lean in now. Yeah, you just gotta have to take turns. Try to lean in. Like I said, if y'all need to take it off the mic stand, y'all can just pass the mic. If y'all gotta do that too. So. Bring it in some more, man. Yeah, take it off. <laughs> you know what? You don't know what he's doing. All right. All right. Yeah, just, really no, to just pull. Right just uh, right, pull this right, right. here. Ooh, hold that for me and just I'm gonna pull it out. There you go. I just got it, bitch. Fuck out of here. And then just take it out. Take out the mic. I just heard six. <laughs> six. Here. You heard one. And then just plug that right back into it. I'll move this out the way for you guys. Sorry for the delay, but shit happens. This is what we do. If you know, if you hold it close enough, we do. Oh, yeah. I'm pretty sure that motherfuckers can definitely. Hello? Hello? Oh, yeah. There so you the go. Front of the mic. Front of the mic. Okay, no, front of the mic. That's the front, yeah. All right. Talking to my thumb, guys. Talking to my thumb, guys. All right. Well, we're here. Uh, for anybody who's new to the channel, just don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and you know, stick Crash around. That like button. You feel me? Uh, rock the bell so you can get the notifications when there's a new episode. And and uh, oh, let's get this going. How's everybody doing? What y'all do today, man? How's everybody doing today? Well, yeah, watch porn. Porn is always good. Hey. What kind of porn do you like to watch, though? That's the question. Someone asked me that recently, so I want to ask I you. I like that. big butt ebony BBWs. Big niggas and black niggas. The more they look like, like a gorilla or a horse, he's just like turned on by that shit. The darker, the better. Bestiality. Whoa, 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 hey, whoa, whoa, it's bestiality whoa. erotica, fucko. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Get it right. Get it right. Get it right. Don't get it fucked up, all right? We have a community page on Facebook. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, what? I mean, like, I like the compilations. I like, I like amateur shit, <clears throat> like straight amateur. Like, porn stars is good. I love porn stars, but... The amateur, the better for me. Though. Yeah. Because it just makes it seem more real. Not not, not good for me, though. The video quality sucks. <laughs> I, need, I need HD. This nigga got a I'm premium. I'm at a point where I need 4K. I need 4K. My man got porn video, standards. Yeah. Niggas, 4K, uh, 1080p. Niggas is if it's not 1080p or better, I don't want to watch it. I don't even want to do the 720p. No more. <laughs> Damn. Damn. This nigga like bougie, bougie being his hell. dick. He bougie he like, as hell uh, being yeah, his shit. Uh, I that like, shit got to be clear. I like Zoom in. He needs to see all the blonde hairs on the butt cheek. Right, <laughs> right. This nigga, we, we're all watching the regular shit. He's watching the videos with the star in the corner and shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got a membership? He got, a, he got, he got, he got the shit? membership. Yo, I saw shit. the ad on the page. It was like, sign up now, get a free year subscription. Yo, Damn. When they, <laughs> but they want your credit card information. And I'm going to let me know all fair. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but you know what's funny? When they actually had that, those, those premiums actually going for free, I was like a while back, probably like last year or something, maybe this year, I forget. But they had those drones free. And I watched it just because I was like, I want to see the difference. Like, what is the difference between the regular and the premium? I had to give it to JQ on this. Those, those quality videos do make a difference, bro. When you I actually played, see... I never paid for the premium. Right, right, <laughs> so I never right, paid right. for the premium. All right, so let me ask you this. Since you've, you've been a nigga that paid for the premium. I didn't pay for it. I just said it was free. It was They, they gave it up for free like a month or a week or whatever. Okay, so you got the free trial. I paid. It was, a free, it was a free trial to give to everybody. Did you enjoy it, though? I enjoyed it because, like you said, the video quality was way crazier. All bro. right, but look, look, look. Let me like, ask you this, though. It was crazier. Since you, since you got the free trial, right, right and right. obviously that... that Leads to a hinkling that you would possibly pay for. No, a subscription. I wouldn't pay for it. You're, you're, you're I'm twisting. just speaking hypothetical. No, you're, you're no, no, switching no, 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 words. No, no. Hypothetically. <laughs> hypothetically. 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 It hypothetically. sounds like he's, 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 he's telling me this is what no, I'm no, doing. No, 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 no. Talking about video quality. Right, right. He's, hypothetically, he's on, since on, you would pay for the right. quality of the video, I wouldn't pay for nothing. All right, I'm. You're yeah, you're getting it twisted. We, we, still. Know, we know you used to premium. Yeah, and we shit, know. But... We know you used to kick me right, right. to the clock. And All right, shit, so but... look, basically, what I'm trying to get to here is: Would you pay for a bitch's OnlyFans? No. 
Because truthfully, you can actually watch some of them bitches on the, on Pornhub for free. Well, <laughs> wait, wait, wait. But what about the bitches you can't watch? Because there's a lot it's of those OnlyFans bitches that's super bro, duper It's not worth it. Bro, that's before I'm paying it. for an OnlyFans or even paying for a fucking subscription to, like, let's just say Bang Bros or something. Not that I watched that one. <laughs> but, like, Bang Bros or something, right? Before I pay for that shit, bro, I'll just get it off to a 30-second video. Yo, free, yo, free, I am infamous, job, bro. Job, I am infamous. Job. The trailers... 30-second video. The trailers is where I get busy, bro. <laughs> I race the trailer. <laughs> Fuck out of here. I race the trailer, bro. If I'm on, but if I'm on Pornhub, bro, it's always got pot, Petite or Latina just, in the Just, just keep so. scrolling and just let the shit preview. Right. <laughs> bro, I'll tell you right now. You go to browsers or you're in between. Bros? You're in between 11 and 14 <laughs> seconds. Like, that's the best I'm part. That's the best part. <laughs> Fuck it. I'm amongst my niggas. I've paid for OnlyFans. I, I figured that I, I was gonna leave. I, I my counter question was gonna be that tons too. of them. <laughs> Yo, that's why this is why we always sparking him up. <laughs> this is why we always tons sparking him up. <laughs> now we know where his money really be going. Not tons of them, but I paid for like you know. So I mean, I'm gonna ask you. So who's like, I, so how I many? Can't put the joint out there. Oh, that's corny. I can't. I can't. I'm not. I'm not. You got doing support. All that. That's low key. I'm not. Well, I'm not gonna do all that. You got support. I'm not gonna do all that. Nah, catch this nigga dry snitching. Fuck that. She was. She put herself up there. That's what she wanna do. Fuck that. It, I mean, promoting. it's not even about her. It's just about other people around her. It might start other situations that I'm trying to avoid. You know what I'm saying? You're not hitting it. I mean, I'm not, but niggas would kind of be mad that I saw the Stopinski. You know what I'm saying? That's not your problem. Why would niggas be mad? She got right. a yeah. Yeah. Right, exactly. Yeah. Nigga, the world is seeing yeah. it. Right, that's yeah. the whole point the of it. The world is seeing it. Come on. He's in his <laughs> feelings about it. He's in his feelings. He doesn't want to share it. That's, that's why. what it is. He's a non sharing <laughs> ass. He don't want to share it. <laughs> He's right, a non sharing ass. like me. I'm on. Like, <laughs> yeah. yo. My queen. Yo, What's up, queen? Like, What's up, queen? He in that drawing like, yo, me, I'm on. You know, I got you next month. Like, you know, I'm going to subscribe every month, baby. Baby, like, baby. <laughs> me, I'm on. <laughs> next time we like, yo, what's up? Next time we like, next time we like, next time we like, yo, Javon, hey, yo. mad cheese. He like, he like, I don't even got it, baby. Like, I'm broke. <laughs> like, what you mean? <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> nah, but, but I respect that. I respect that. But I was gonna ask you, like, it, the reason for you to ask it has to be like you had to try. Honestly, bro, I'm gonna keep Not it a bad. buck, bro. I was so fucking curious. I really wanted to see what the toto looked like, and I was like, fuck it. The bitch, the bitch had a special was for like $5 for the month. Oh, her pussy whacked that. Five? <laughs> bitch, check this $5. Fuck out of here. Skinny Chip Road Tats? Skinny Chip Road Tats. You know what it is. Bro, that I cum shot was so weak, bro. Her cum shot was so weak. No. You saw it too? No. <laughs> I've seen that video before of her. Uh, <laughs> is that the one you so told you me about? For yeah. old videos. Okay, 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 okay. So you okay, paying okay. for, you for old videos, bro? Oh, uh, you's a sucker. Suck. I know JQ not watching that <laughs> shit because that shit was at like 440 quality, bro. Yeah, he never seen it. Nope, HD only. <laughs> Sad part, I ain't gonna lie, but sad part, when you told me about that, I actually went to go search. I was like, I gotta see this video now, and I couldn't find it. But still, like, I was, I had to see this video, but I didn't find that shit. But that shit, I did, that shit but, smacked her cheek and was so thick, it didn't even yeah, turn me on, bro. Oh, she just dying. dropped icing on her face. Oh, that's the whack. Yeah, it was a whack. Right. Dude, the dude was probably jerking off before he fucked. <coughs> okay. <coughs> do you, I was gonna say that. Is that, for some guys, I guess, like, for me personally, like, I don't care to do that before or not. Be well, personally. No, I do. Yeah, yeah. I do it all the time. Do you? I've yeah. done it a few times. I mean, I've but, done that probably a few times, but not purposely, I guess you could say. Nah, I blast, bro. I mean, the few I times blast. I have. So, like, I can before, and I still got, like, a good amount where I look like a fucking porn star and an action figure. <laughs> 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 fucking action now figure over here. Right, and shit. Bro, I, but I purposely do it, bro, just hey, so, like, I got that longevity John, later on. Fuck with that. Keith Lee. Oh, that nigga big as hell. Yeah, athletic as hell, too. <laughs> but nah, that's funny. Like, it's funny because, like, I've never tried to do that purposely. Like some guys, like like you said, you tried it. Like guys, most guys, I, 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 honestly, I, think I, I, I have to admit, I think least. I'm trying to fuck her belly button. I'm, not, I'm trying to fill the belly button up, bro. I'm trying to make a pool <laughs> on her belly. Pool on the belly button. You know what I'm saying? This man is a total freak in the sheets. I tell you. <laughs> you know, I, 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 I you know, I'll, I'll admit something to you though. There is one girl that I found out who just got an OnlyFans, right? Okay. I follow her on Instagram. I'll show y'all who she is after, but. I always had a little crush on her because she's a cosplayer. Like, she's a cosplayer, you okay, feel okay, me? Okay. So she's she's Jewish, John, cute as hell. Mm. But then... Is she petite? She's short. That falls into petite. Right, yeah. right, right. Ah. John is like, but she's like still... But as she's, long as she's within the body mass index. Right, and that's that's what I'm about to get to. Like, she's still, like, not 
small, but she's not she's thick, thick. thick. Oh, all right, all but right. she's still thick enough. Like she got a nice ass, uh, nice titties. Perfect. Right, perfect. right. She got like a dwarf butt. <coughs> she got like that hump when she walk. Maybe. I mean, I, I maybe. <laughs> Bro, but, I'm just bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but no, nah, but she does have an ass. <laughs> nah, but she does have ass. <laughs> point is, Yo, who rolled that? Me. And and it's, kudos. Yeah. But point is, fucking, say, she bro? just, she just recently got or started promoting like an OnlyFans page, okay. and I was just like, holy shit! Like, it got me curious. <laughs> I was like, were you excited enough to like think about pot, like? Well, I was excited enough to be like curious to be like, damn, I would, I would want to see it, but I don't. Did you pay go for on it. and check how much it was? I did. I ain't gonna lie to you. You would pay for it? No, but I wouldn't though. I'm bro. I don't even like paying for weed, and I love smoking. Think about Who that. Bro, I'm not weed. paying for an OnlyFans, bro, when I can go to a strip club. Sorry. But you got to pay for Very that, much too. True. Right, bro, but it's right but there. there. time. Yeah. Right. Good things happen because Again, I'm a good-looking nigga. I'd rather be behind the screen. I can do nastier <laughs> I shit. I can be a complete freak <laughs> now. In the quiet-ass <laughs> nigga. <laughs> Why not? What do you mean? Why not? <laughs> he probably do got a whole shit. fake profile picture and everything. Yeah, we're nah, beat. His name online beep is Mark Henry. His name is probably. Beep beep. <laughs> <laughs> insider, hey, insider, insider. insider. Me, me, you right now. <laughs> his name probably Johnny Deep on there and shit. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> <laughs> Yo, <laughs> Yo, Yo, I had, Yo, someone was using my pictures on the catfish profile, bro. Get that, bro. I, bro. Oh shit. My ex sent me sent me a Tinder profile. But then, like, I, I showed her my Tinder profile. I was like, it's not it's not me. Mm-hmm. Bro, that shit was hilarious, bro. But they picked some of my good pictures. I can't even be mad. But they they was liking me with the braids, whoever it was. Ugly ass nigga. <laughs> imagine that shit, though, right? Like, catfish somebody with someone else's shit. That's creepy, That's bro. creepy as hell. But imagine how times I've seen all the dick pictures. So, like, what if it's, like, one of my exes <laughs> or, like, someone I sent a dick picture to using me as a catfish? You know what I'm saying? That's hilarious. Now they got the full package and we're probably making money off me. Facts. I didn't think of it like that. Now they got OnlyFans. Bro. <laughs> Yo, word. Think about how many bitches Yo, I only probably got a secret OnlyFans out there, bro. But it doesn't really matter because I used the same dick pic for 10 years. You feel me? <laughs> the same one. Perfect lighting. <laughs> per- was... Perfect lighting perfect and lighting. everything. <laughs> how the fuck you had the same picture for 10 years? You done changed your phone like 17 umpteen times. iCloud, baby. <laughs> Listen, man. <laughs> He said, listen, man. This nigga been sending himself p- photographs in the email long before iCloud, nigga. <laughs> I'll take a picture. I'll email it to myself on a different account, and I'll delete it off my phone. See, here we go. See, see. There we go. There's the answer. So you want answer. the fucking recipe? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta do it play by play and shit. <laughs> How do you do it? <laughs> Thanks, bro. Uh, so, so, I'm going to use the tactics. Yo, earlier, Javon, he comes up to me, and he's like, yo, do you ever feel bad for just... What was it? What, what were you, bro? <laughs> for always, for like always shooting your shot. He's like, you ever feel thirsty for always shooting your yeah, shot? Yeah, yeah, I was like, yo, you ever feel thirsty for like, like shooting your shot for at so many bitches, bro? Like, fuck. I was like, no, because like, I like I'm nonchalant, bro. Like, I don't feel, I ever feel like I'm pressing a female. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So like, if you're not pressing someone, they don't feel awkward. If they don't, you know what I'm saying? You can't be thirsty if you make if you're unless you're making someone awkward feel mm-hmm. awkward. Because so if you, you know what I'm saying? Because then they like you. So let me ask you this then. So what 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 do you think are the most um, how do I just, how do I put this word? This um, what are the most f- dumb or wrong things to do when you're trying to DM a girl? Then, like, thank, what what are most thank guys? Thank them mistakes? for adding you as a friend. Never say that <laughs> shit, bro. Never <laughs> say that. Thanks for adding. Thanks me. for the ad. You know what I'm saying? Yo, fuck out of here. <laughs> That's something Javon would do. Nah, fuck out Thanks for the ad, queen. Me, I'm on. <laughs> 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 Kisses and all that. <laughs> she opens up her Instagram. She got 13 liked pictures and six DMs. <laughs> like, damn. 13 likes and six DMs. Four of them say, Can I get your number? <laughs> like, damn. Like, like, damn, you gonna fucking ignore me, bitch? <laughs> or the infamous. Don't I know you from somewhere? Nah. <laughs> Oh, that man. is definitely probably the worst, I think. I, and I ain't gonna lie, I'll admit, I was, I'm, I was even like, a victim nah, of that once or twice. Like, I've done that stupid shit. Like, yo, don't have... And I, it's because I really do know them, like, from somewhere, but I just don't <laughs> remember where. And I always do that. I guess I did that before, and, yeah, they'll never reply. I'm like, all right, that was stupid, I guess. You know what I mean? So, you live and you learn, but... Bro, like, honestly, like, I hate DMing yeah, females. I hate, I hate DMing females, bro. So, like, the most I do, bro, is, like, you know how you got the reactions on Instagram where you just, like... 
throwing throw emoji. with the emoji. Bro, I, it's just shit. emojis all day. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> that's it. That's it. That's it. Yeah, yeah. I do and that a lot. And sometimes conversation like pops. Bro, I'm way better like talking to people in person than I am online. Mm. So like, yeah, that's how I feel too. I'm more of a, I'm more of a face to face because I feel like online. I feel like whatever I'm saying does not come out the way or smooth as I want it to come out. The you feel what I'm saying? Do not come out the way you the want it to. <laughs> because you know what it is? The voice means a lot, baby. Like, if, right. if you ain't got no voice behind the words, it just doesn't feel or sound the same. You know what I mean? So it's like, I feel, this, I feel what you're saying. Like, when you're in person, you can definitely say think, some I shit think, and I rebound I I from something. I sound better than I, than I text. Right, right. Same here, same here. I, I agree. I, I feel but the like same way. Females, like, a lot of, like, a lot of times, bro, like, females start conversations with me, bro. It's, it's easier, I yeah, think. Yeah, bro. Like, now nah, I'm comfortable. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> See? So, to all you females out there who think, oh, I shouldn't go approach a guy. That's one of the best them. thing you could probably we fucking do. We love that do. shit. Because you're making it 10 times easier and making it 10 times just less Damn, awkward. Are you trying to make them easy? <laughs> huh? You trying to make it easy? Nah, man. I don't want to make, make it easy, that. but don't like... that because then, you know... Females well, like men that like to hunt, bro. Well, so. not... Well, those when Obviously, as males, we should always still know we got to hunt. You feel me? We should always still put the initiative. But sometimes, too, uh, you know, you got those guys or you even got just women who are just scared to approach something when it's like, just do the hunt, too. Because right. you got to think about it. A, a, a lioness hunts her, her you know. Or, hunts or, for the food, right. Right, or whatever the case may be, too. You feel me? It goes it goes both ways when you think about it naturally. You know right, what right, I mean? Right, 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 I think a lot of people get that fucked up, too, though. You know, they, 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 they think it's always got to be just one way. Damn, man. Warning, warning, lungs. warning. <laughs> about to explode. <laughs> Damn, somebody take that mic from me before you get you. That shit is crazy. I'm glad in a way that he's doing that because when I had it, I'm like, yo, I'm dying. <laughs> I'm like, yo, what the fuck is that, bro? Cook a right. fuck, like, bro. is the window cracked? <laughs> what is that shit? I might have to open the window more. Yeah, actually, <laughs> shit. This joint is kind of icicle, some shit. Yeah. Just, Ice cream cook. You're gonna, ice, hear, ice you're gonna hear a voice from downstairs like ice Angel. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> facts, facts. probably. It she, stinks. Yeah, <laughs> always stinks. I'm on it. I'm on it. I know you got the guys over, but <laughs> <laughs> nah, I said, say y'all, y'all, y'all saving my eyes, and I, <laughs> not to even, and I shouldn't even be saying that on live, but fuck it, yeah, I'll be real. Like, if it was my mom, she'd come in here all day. They tan cara, they tan cara, ho ponieta, mira. Even with um moms now though, like we wouldn't have done that when we were young. Mm-hmm. Now we older, so it's like all right, we we yeah. still getting bitched at like we young, but oh uh, yeah, we wouldn't have thought about doing that shit when we were young. It's crazy, bro. Yo, it's crazy, yo. Being a father and shit, I was I was taking a run and shit the other day, and I'm thinking to myself how my dad used to tell me back in the day, like. Yeah, I used to get up at 4 o'clock in the morning. I used to run like four miles, go to work, come home, cook dinner, wipe your ass, take you jump to put fences, you to bed, jump fences. the river to get right. to school. <laughs> right, all this crazy shit. And I'm running like, I can't wait to tell my son all this joke shit. <laughs> That's that old man. Hey, like, look, that. listen, I can't wait oh, to oh, tell oh. him this bullshit. Like, nigga, I get up every day, run two miles. You see those mountains? All <laughs> <laughs> right. I could throw a big skin a quarter mile over the mountains. mountains. You see those mountains? You see those mountains over there, big boy? That dad could throw over the mountains, baby. That dad was all state. Look you up on Google, like, damn, you ain't even got no fucking fuck record. You didn't even play real. Yes. You didn't even play for the team, nigga. I got too close to the mic when I said that. <laughs> that shit fucking he ate that shit, real quick. that shit started spiking. Jesus. <laughs> so I gotta lower that part, but that's bad funny. So, man, how did everybody feel about their draft today, man? Ooh. We did our fantasy draft today, people, so I ain't gonna lie. I, let, me, I, let me cut mine short, right? So, <laughs> I was able to pick up, like, the first three people. After that, everything was auto-draft, so I was like, fuck. But overall, mm-hmm. I, I think I, I did pretty good, though. I think I did pretty good. Who was your first Yeah, team you pick? got a solid team. Hold on, let's just pull it up so it's just way easier. Yeah, facts, facts. Wait, everybody, I guess everybody put I got a little... it real quick. I got it. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, we got the commission, the co-commission, man. All right, Yo, so I'm just gonna go from left to right. Keep it simple. My first pick, my first pick was, uh, well, my keeper was Julio. My first pick, I believe it was James Conner. After that, I picked up um, Beckham, and then I picked up uh, DK Metcalf. Then the rest of my uh, picks were um, now I did pick up Prescott. The rest of my picks were um, I got it right here. It's uh, you picked up James Conner. 
Perception. Then it was Odell. Which shocked me. Then you picked up DK. That didn't shock me at all. Then Todd Gurley. Then DeAndre Swift. Then. No, then you grabbed Dak. Then Higby. Yeah, you grabbed Dak. <clears throat> that was autoed. My shit was getting autoed. And then you were, I think you were, no, you were the second person to grab a defense. Eighth round. I grabbed that shit was autoed. Yeah. All of that was autoed. Oh, so it was just trying to fill your starters rather than hunt. Let's see. Oh, 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 oh now, now it has it in the app, so I can see. Look, you drafted seventh, and you ended up. Uh, you got a B minus. He, he had a B minus. Yeah, okay. I already tried to pick I got to see. Up two there, you look, there you go. That's you. Okay. Yeah, I already tried to pick up two. Pieces. And then you got the top kicker, Harrison Bucker for the Chiefs. I got two pending. You about to get all points. And then Jovan has his best team ever. If he does bad this year, I'm gonna be so mad at him. What's the fucking grade? That's all I want. Oh, your grade? Hold on. C. Javon, you got a C, yeah. Bad. I got a C too, though. <coughs> That's what I'm saying. I got a C too for average. some reason. <coughs> it's not bad. The low, that was the lowest in the draft. Those C's. Me, yeah. you, and uh, someone else got C. Angel, yeah, got a C. I got a C minus or some shit like that. What? The fuck? Oh, yeah. C plus. C plus. I'm sorry. Yeah, but even then, that's still, that's yeah, crazy. Still bro, how do I have a C-plus when I got Patrick Mahomes and Christian and McCaffrey? McCaffrey, right. McCaffrey. That right there is a fucking... Amari Cooper and Amari Cooper. All right, nah, all right. you know what? You drafted Jerry Judy too early. That's probably what it was. You drafted him, what, fourth? That's the only look. Because the most mock drafts, when I was playing, most of those rookies, bro, was drafting and drafted, like, late rounds like and shit. No, <laughs> later than that. Later than that. Uh, Someone was like 16. I think early was like 16. I saw, and that was the it was Judy. I think someone grabbed. Yo, it says my best pick was Debo nah, Samuel. That shit wasn't going. That shit wasn't going to fly because we got the we got the, the rookie. rookie. Yeah, the rookie flex we and shit. Flex yeah, so got we, we, we when we play, we got a rookie flex and we have an extra flex. You feel me? So <clears throat> that's what it, that's why we had to draft rookies and shit. Like I got uh I got DK uh Jake my fault I got JK Dobbins. So he gonna kick up though. I, I'm 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 really convinced he's gonna kick up. Um, who did I get? Hugs. Hugs the third. Yeah, you got rugs. Oh, rugs. Hold on, why the fuck am I? <laughs> man, it might be hugs. Hugs, hugs, whatever. <coughs> no, it is hugs. <coughs> <coughs> well, I can look right now because I'm supposed to be facing you anyway. <coughs> first week? Yeah, I play you first week. Yeah, I think it's hugs. Yeah, oh, I didn't know. Yeah, it's rugs. It's rugs. Yeah, rugs the third. I always forget his last name too. I always like hugs or rugs. But anyway. My point is though, you got fucking Derrick Henry too. That pissed me off. <laughs> you, yeah, you, you, you really fucked up a lot of my draft. I ain't gonna I lie fucked to up you. a lot of people's drafts. I grabbed a couple niggas. My neat was looking at too. Because you grabbed, you grabbed rugs when I was gonna try to grab rugs that round. You grabbed fucking. I didn't even know you grabbed Henry until now. Cause I was looking for him. I grabbed Henry early, like fifth round. You grabbed him as your first pick. Or, damn! Look, first pick. I don't blame you though. That's why when I went, I was looking at the. I had to look at the running backs first before I picked up Adams because I needed to make sure. Well, I already had Hollywood as my keeper, so it was like, all right, I'm gonna get a running back. Right, right. That shit crazy. <coughs> man. I mean, like, I, I right now this this is who I got on my shit. So I have Josh Allen, Devontae Adams, DJ Moore, Leonard Fournette, Davlin Cook, Hunter Henry. I want to cook. Uh, Cortland Sutton. Uh, J.K. Dobbins, and then my bench right now is David Johnson, Kenyon Drake, Kareem Hunt, Darius Slayton, Austin Hooper, Emmanuel Sanders, and uh, Miko Hardman. Okay. And then my kicker is uh, what Matt Gay, I believe his name is. What defense you got? Yeah, Matt Gay, and I got my oh, uh, Chargers defense. Chargers. Yeah, because I like Bosa, I like James, and I, uh, I mean some of the other guys that got there too. Uh, Sad to say, I can't believe this shit, but I got Dallas defense this year. Uh, that that surprised me when you picked that yeah, up. Yeah, bro. Like, I don't know, bro. The niggas is looking like they gonna be a problem on defense this year, dog. All I can say is if they got a lot of weapons over there. All I can say is if y'all need running backs, let me know. If niggas need wide receivers, holla at me. Fuck the both of you, dog. I'm taking this championship. I'm trying, man. With this my year. squad. Squad. Yeah, I'm only going to do one trade. And honestly, the only trade I want to do right now is going to be with either Lou for the quarterback or 
someone else for a wide receiver. Cause I like I like my wide receivers, but I want somebody else to really match. I got nothing Adams. but receivers. Who you got? We're gonna talk trades right now. I got Fuck the it. Squad, bro. You gonna it's, it's gonna take a lot to take one of my guys. But I got Amari Cooper, Julian Edelman, Jerry Judy, mm-hmm. Marvin Jones Jr., Christian Kirk, Robbie Anderson, Debo Samuel, Mike Williams. All solid receivers. The only person I would really want f- from your wide receiver core would be Debo or Kirk. Kirk, bro, about to get so many targets, bro, because D Hop about to have defenses worried. Worried, bro. yep. And he's going to be in the slot just open. Because he's going to play the slot. And you guys, you still got Larry Fitz, so. Yeah, I'm not going to play him the first week. They play San Fran. Shit, for me, they got Kenyon Drake projected 15 in the, against San Fran, which is yeah, I have honestly Kenyon surprising. Other I'm real confident in this year's squad. Yeah, I like, I, I don't know. I like, I like this shit. I mean, for the fact <laughs> that I got a shitty fucking round. I got shitty picks. I mean, not shitty picks, but shitty, uh, you know, out of eighth round pick, man. That sucks, dude. Like. Eighth round picks fucking blow. Cause even on the way back, you're still waiting for three rounds. You know what I mean? Like it's just so whack. By then it's like you really gotta know who you wanna pick. That's why I had to pick Fournette early. I had to pick Austin Hooper early, just in case uh Hunter Henry gets fucking injured this year. You know what I mean? Like I had to do some early picks just because of that sh- because of that shit. The fact that niggas like Kareem Hunt slide into like Past his projection was crazy though. I ain't gonna lie to you. He was projected fifty nine pick. He I got him like sixty eight or some shit. Who Kareem? Yeah, I mean he's gonna be back up with Nick Chubb's, but when he get the ball, Nick bro, Chubb is a horse. No, nah, Nick Chubb is definitely a horse, but so is Kareem, dog. Niggas forget that. He gonna show off and either get traded or he gonna just show off and just leave next year. You feel me? That's how I look at it. Cause when he get the ball in his hand, he, he's gonna he's gonna be a problem. Shit. So y'all seen the fucking the the Snyder cuts yet? The trailers? You haven't checked out the no, tape? No. Y'all still haven't? You the, the deep cousin's face like what? They so basically the director uh, Snyder is gonna be uh, remaking the Justice League movie. I don't know if you heard that or heard about that, but yeah, they had a trailer. Shit's going, yeah, it's going to be dope. Shit, I don't even remember the first Justice League movie. Shit was whack. Nobody liked it. I didn't even see it and I heard it was whack as shit. Most of the DC movies are horrible. Yeah, Not they're... horrible, but they're, they're, they try hard. Well, I liked the Wonder Woman. I didn't get to see all of it, but whatever I did see was good. I didn't get to see Aquaman yet, but everybody said it was good. But other than that, I, I mean, liked Aquaman. Did you? Yeah, everybody said that. A lot of people said that. Aquaman was good. I mean, I've seen Suicide Squad. That was okay, but... I fucked with Suicide Squad. You gotta speak low. You gotta speak closer, bro. I fucked with Suicide Squad. What you liked about it though, the most? I I liked the storyline. It was a cool little plot twist, you know what I mean, at the end and shit. I liked uh, Will Smith's character, and I liked the chick that played Harley Quinn. She did a pretty decent job. I like her, you know what I'm saying? She definitely brought some life to the Harley Quinn character because I feel like every time you see Harley Quinn. In these Batman movies, like she's played like super weak. You know what I mean? They just like really downplay her. Mm-hmm. And I really like how they just like I was like, all right, fuck it, we just gonna give her the lead role, just wild out. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she played. The, I mean, she's definitely the perfect. There's some people you just our actors and actresses. There's just some who just be like, yo, they just that's just them. Like that right, role right, is right. them. You know what I mean? There's no ifs ands or buts about it. <coughs> that's like the fucking like this nigga with Iron Man. Um, yeah. Right, Robert Downey Jr. Yeah, going to go down literally the only and probably the best, the best, the best, and probably the only fucking Iron Man ever. And um, and the boy that play uh, they that played Wolverine, um, fuck was Hugh Jackman. Hugh Jackman. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about a new Wolverine though. That's one of my favorite characters. Yeah, so I, like, I don't, I don't want to see nobody else play Wolverine at this point. Keep yeah, it real. I don't. I can't. Yeah. I I don't, I don't think I'd accept it. Super, uh, Spider-Man is like, all right, I don't give a fuck. I don't care. Because so many people done played that nigga. It's like, who gives a fuck? Well, I give a fuck. I don't I care. I do now, but yo, Tom Holland's going to do that shit forever, I hope. I hope so. I hope they keep it going to the point where 
Yeah, yeah that's Tom yeah. Holland. Yeah, that's the young boy, right? Yeah, yeah, that's the new He's one. cool. He's cool. I like him. Hey, that's what he's supposed to be. Right, right, right. Because Tom McGuire was too old, and right, he got way too Garfield old. Garfield was. I, I, I ain't go. I didn't really like the Garfield Spider Mans too much. I thought they were kind of. Eh. Eh. Yeah, yeah, just. It was just, especially the second one. Like I didn't, I fell asleep. Like second one was garbage. I'm gonna be real with you. Yeah, really he passed him like so. He gets. I actually liked all of them. Like all of what? Hold it, nigga. Well, talk to me about it. This is. Yeah, I actually like all of them. But which ones though? Like, like literally from the ver- first one, like Maguire's to Tom Holland, like to all of them, to 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 where all the different Spider Man. Okay, okay. I was just a fan of it. But all right, so I who's your like favorite though? That's the question. What bull was out of all the guy. three, out of three, because there's only three of them. Mine's just Tom Holland. Just throw it out there now. Which I, one is that, though? That's the newest one. That's the young kid. For the one that was on the Avengers? Yeah, yeah, him. Yeah, I think it'll have to be him. Because I like the other younger dude, too. Which I one? I don't, I don't, I don't, I suck, I suck because I don't know their names and shit. What was the one with Venom? That was with Tom McGuire. I like I, you think, I, think it's the, I think it was the one for the homecoming one. That's is it the, that's the that was boy. the other that's the young boy. Yeah, that's young boy. That's, that's, the, that's Andrew. Yeah, I like the newest one. I mean, that's um I think, Tom I think Holland. He was the, the coolest one. The yeah, one that was on the Avengers. I think he's the most fittest one. I mean, he fits the character. You know, what I mean, in a sense, he's supposed to be the, the young geek and still going through his stages and shit and whatever the case may be. And he fits the pretty much the the jokey side of him. Like he's the like, oh, shit, you know what I mean? Like, okay, you know what I mean? Nah, and he goes yeah, with a joke, you know? He play it real good, like, comic, like, yeah, well, like how he was. Like how he's supposed to be, right. Cartoon, <laughs> stuff like that. Definitely, definitely. He's childish. Right, he's, he fits the character. I mean, you know, just it made it better. That's why, I like, with the, like they fucking just dropped the, uh, Friday just came out with the new the movie, The New Mutant. Yeah, New Mutants, I think they're, that the movie's called. That's gonna probably going to be setting into, like, with the whole X-Men shit and, so yeah, I gotta watch that. yeah, yeah, it's something. It's something new that they literally just dropped it on Friday in theaters. But I don't know any theater that's gonna be playing it. So yeah, that's what it says. Hey, coming in theaters Friday, and you know. So I don't know. You could probably catch it online. <laughs> you know what I mean? But it was supposed to be released already. I think. Yeah, back in back. like yeah, back in like March, I believe. And shit, the one guy that's in the movie is just from uh, Stranger Things, Jonathan. Talking about Stranger Things, I can't wait for the new season to come out. You're telling me about Bro, it, dude. I got like I'm, I don't really be into like too many TV shows and series or whatever. Like I don't really be into that, but that one was like I was in that shit. Yeah. I was in it. I was like, yo, Stranger Things, yeah. I was, like, <laughs> fucking binge watching that shit. I I, I also like the uh, um. <laughs> You fucking me up. My bad. I was trying to say you just speak of the mic because you gotta can't hear you. Um, dang, the Wu Tang. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't yeah. think you ever seen it. Did no, you I seen it. I seen it, bro. You get it? Did you ever see it? I was watching yeah. you to watch right, it. bro. Fire. What you Fire. Think about that shit? I love that shit, bro. So good. So good, bro. So, so good. good. There's supposed to be a second season. I'm waiting. Gosh. I wish they would do a second season. Bro, when when down. they when yeah, when's it coming out though? Like we've Who been knows? waiting for a while, man. What the fuck? Right now, for <laughs> real, it's, only, it's about to be like literally like a whole year and a half, maybe since it came out, or a year at least. It's been a minute. It's bullshit. It's this is crazy. Like they're holding out on us. Yeah, cause I I freaking watch. I binge watched all. The, well, try to binge watch it as much. I got to a point that I had to wait for like every episode to come out at that point, but it was good. Y'all seen a uh, Warrior Nun though? Warrior men? It, warrior none. The fuck is that? No. Bro. That show, bro. It's on Netflix. If y'all got Netflix, check it out. It's fucking dope. It's about basically nuns who are warriors, bro. Like, and they fuck wow. shit up, bro. Like, they be fucking shit up. Like, it's, it's a good ass show, bro. That's all I can say. It's a good ass show. Yeah, I, I need to see that then. That sounds uh, it's very interesting. Good. It's very good, bro. And the one girl, the main girl that plays it, oh, she's fucking, I ain't gonna lie, like, she's, I got, like, a crush on her. She's sexy we, as hell. We talking about nuns here, brother. No, but this girl, the actress, she's fucking, she, oh, she's so cute. You get to see okay. the nuns naked? No, 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 no. no oh, all right. But, like, they do show, like, you know, like, her and her panties or bra or whatever, but, you know, other than oh. that, 
Ooh. Well, you're right. You never get to see nothing like that. Yeah. <laughs> but, like, I was saying, like, you know. Unless you watch watching porn. The main character who's about, who it's about, um, I forget her name. Ava, I think her name. Yeah, Ava. She's, that's what I'm talking about. She's, like, a, apparently, out, like, she's, a, like, Brazilian, Portuguese, like, soap opera actress or some shit. I even did. But, yeah, that's what I'm saying. I was just like, oh, wow, she's beautiful, though, man. And she can act. Like, she can act her ass off. I'll give her that. She's a good actress for the role, so. Check it out, though. It's a good movie. They they be wilding out, bro. Angels, demons, all that type of shit. It's crazy, bro. It's fucking dope. I still got to see the... Know that shit, Johnny? The the Blood Five, right? The Five Bloods. Yeah, yeah. I got to see uh, that I shit. have not seen that. R.I.P. To our guy, Chadwick. Chad Bozeman, yeah, man. That's, yeah, that's, that was crazy, bro. I know he just died like that. Word up. And then people being all... Like, the people that was rude about him, dog, like, before he died, like, how he's looking and shit, is fucked up, man. Honestly, that's kind of like a double-edged sword because you didn't, you nobody knew, you know what I'm saying? And but that's like, the point. I mean, yeah, I get that, I get that. But if he didn't die, no one would be saying anything about it. Very much. Like true. if it came out like, oh, he got cancer and niggas was making fun of him, then possibly, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? But if he didn't die, nobody would have said anything about people making jokes about his his fucking weight, bro. No, you right. And how he lost weight, bro. Nobody really would have cared. And that's where I look at it where it's like, come on now, let's be real. Do you really give a fuck that people was talking shit about the fact that, you know what I mean, he's looking a little skinnier than he was a few months ago or whatever with you, the case may be? You really don't. People didn't really give a fuck about that. Just, just That was just people having something to say, like, oh, uh, you know, nigga, it was fucked up. That niggas made jokes about him last, you know what I mean, two weeks ago. And look, yeah, it was, but... You really don't, like, you don't know him. What kind of personal interest do you really have in this? You know what I'm saying? You just stirring the pot. Mm-hmm. Well, that's a lot. I think that's, that goes for a lot of things, then. What's going on a lot in this world. A lot of things are just stirring the pot. Right. And nobody's really knowing what's the full ingredients, you know? That's the crazy part. That's why it's up to niggas like us to stay woke and be like, all right, nigga, we prep cooks. So I don't got to worry about what the fuck they got going on in the kitchen with the soups. Because, mm-hmm. nigga, all I got to do is bring them the carrots. You feel me? Yeah, but I don't know. It's just so many crazy, weird shit in this world. That's all I can say. I'm used, to, like I said, you seen the, that little video. Well, you ain't see all of it, but yeah, I, I, and I've seen enough. I've seen enough. All right. So imagine watching all ten of that shit, bro. All ten of that shit really be like, what the fuck? And the yeah, thing is, though, once you deep in that shit, bro. You know, and, 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 and he is, but you know what? I, I understand why, cause I watched it more than once already. Right. You know what I mean? I watched the the fall of Cabal. You didn't see that video. Johnny ain't with the shit. Yeah, it's 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 basically <laughs> a video. I like I said, if you want to know, I'll send you the video. But it's basically what it is: the video that explains in parts, like what shit is going on in the world from like a, a you know pretty much as people people say a conspiracy standpoint. But, like, it explains about, like, you know, the certain political views, the fucking, you know, Pizzagate shit, you know, the Pizzagate scandal, the fucking emails from, you know, from Hillary to Obama to Podesta to even the nigga from Lincoln Park, you know what I mean? Like, who killed Chester? himself. Yeah, yeah Chester, Chester, bro. All that shit, bro. Like, every... was fighting against the Clinton administration. Yeah, bro. Like, fighting against all that shit and basically just trying to, like, <laughs> stop, you know, the... The kid trafficking and you know all that shit, the sacrificing, red shoes, like all. What's that? What's red shoes? So you didn't get that far in the video. Yeah, I didn't get that far. Yeah, red shoes, bro. They, some artists or some actresses, whatever, whoever, they wear these red shoes that symbolize basically like they ate they a kid. The they ate the kid or done something with a ritual with a kid or. Oh, that's what the red is for. Mm-hmm. Some of them even go as far as taking. The skins of those kids or whatever the kids be and make them oh, into the shoe. Yeah, bro. I'm not sure if I want to watch this. It's sick, bro. Like you don't see it, obviously, but like it's just a video this that really opens. Just sounds too weird for me, bro. It's weird, but <laughs> it's a weird where it really. This is a lot of different subjects we're talking about here. But that's what I say. That's why it's in ten parts because every part is a different. It's a different subject, subject and it connects. That's what I'm saying. I, it's up to you. How long is each video? Because video you're asking me to dedicate about, time. I want to say the video is about, I forget, I think two hours. It's like two and a half hours. Yeah, the whole video, I believe. All ten parts is like two and a half hours. 
My niece had to try to make us watch it one day, and I, I, I couldn't. Yeah, like if you're gonna watch it, I suggest this is what I did. That's why I watched it in part. Uh, this right, and this is what I did. I literally watched up to I think part four. Took a break, smoked again. You feel me? Like did some other shit just to keep my mind busy. Right, but like, rest, and then came back. And then I came just don't back. know if I want this shit weighing on my mind, bro. I mean, like I said, it's up to you. I don't have to really show it to you, but I'm just saying though, like, I don't know, but like I'm curious, but then I'm not. Curiosity killed the cat. But, you know, I ain't no like, pussy, bro. <laughs> That's what it's like no pussy, me. bro. Nah, because what it is, it, it really just explains, like, even with, like, Macaulay Culkin, like, he had a little quote. That's what that. <laughs> That's what that. <laughs> Shout out, because he's actually coming back to the new American Horror, American Horror Story or whatever. Really? Yeah, he's coming, he's making a season. Oh, no way. Yeah, he's doing the season no with them. Way. Get them. It's going to be oh, out of here. Culkin? Macaulay Culkin. And apparently, he's going to have sex with, like, no, nah, well, uh, I wish because Lady Gaga's fucking sexy. But yo, Hotel was my favorite season. Hotel was my favorite. <laughs> Hotel is definitely probably my favorite. But um, anyway, point is he had a quote about that shit because he's one of those people that tries to fight against the fucking, Jaw you know, track. yeah, all that shit. And he was saying like how like a dude approached him one time when he was at like the Jay Leno show or some shit, at backstage and was like talking to him and was trying to like prep him and take him somewhere type shit. You know, pretty much molest him and shit. And then, you know, he didn't go, and the dude kept talking to him. He was just like, oh, you know, like, he said some shit like, you know, you like these red shoes. He was like, you know, you know how they were made or whatever. And he told him, he's like, they made from you. And insinuating, like, they're made from kids. You know what I mean? They're made from child stars like you or people like you. You know what I mean? Like, it's fucking weird, bro. When you get into it, like, it's deep. Down to the adrenal chrome, them eating adrenal chrome and shit, trying to stay younger and... and yeah. Heart, you know, it's like the, it's like the best the drug for them, you know what I mean? Or for human <laughs> beings in general, any person who eats it or whatever, drinks the blood or whatever of it. You supposedly you, have, like, everlasting life. You basically, shit. you stay younger. It, it, it rejuvenates your youth, your youth. But when you mm. don't eat it or drink it... It kills you. It basically slowly kills you. So you basically fiend for the shit. Right. Like a nigga would crack. And if you don't get the shit, you fuck up and die and withdraw. Fucking why you think? Why you think those those niggas who got caught with the what was that article? The art, the people that was selling all the furniture and shit for like fifty thousand dollars, twenty thousand dollars. Wayfair, shit. you got just yeah. what I need. Those niggas. That's why they were selling shit for a high price because that shit is high price to them. You know what I mean? Those kids were selling. Them niggas were selling kids and selling bodies. Kids. Yep. Just so they can get their little high or whatever the case may be. That's what Pizza Gate's about. You sick motherfuckers. That's what the pizza gate scam is about. So, like I said, I'm not gonna get too much. I don't want to get too, 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 too deep into that shit because I try not to stay on that too subject for too long. Creepy. But it's, I don't mind it. But I don't. I know Look, a lot bro, of people I'm don't like bad. hearing that it. That but shit creeps me the fuck out. You hit me? No, it creeps don't me out. Yeah, but, but you over but here watching this angle, shit like, with my son. But I'm talking like, I mean, you know, I mean, you gotta stay informed. You gotta know what the fuck is going on. Bro, I'm informed and I ain't watching. <laughs> Man, you ain't informed, bitch. You over here mouth open like, ooh, what's this and that? Nah, bro, video. you just I'm like intrigued. this shit because you got that old white man. That every time I see you, you <laughs> be getting on, out of his car. Yeah, on, you be getting out of his car all sweaty. <laughs> get out of his car oh, all sweaty, God. fixing your pants and shit. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Talking about Jeff just gave me $30. <laughs> <laughs> just gave me $30. <laughs> you got a name, though. Oh, God. He really do. That's what makes it even yeah. better. That's what makes the story believable. <laughs> like, <laughs> that one name. Yo. That one name. <laughs> Makes the whole thing believable. Every time one of y'all see someone named Jeffrey, you're like, you know, you know Javon? <laughs> <laughs> you know Javon? <laughs> yeah. That's going to be great. <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> <read that. laughs> That's going to be so good to hear when I hear, so, when I hear someone say, like, oh, my name's Jeff. I'm like, oh, you know Javon? <laughs> He's like, no. I'm like, who the fuck is that? You know Javon. Or if you just call Javon, you just call Javon, like, is this the Jeff you were talking about? <laughs> <laughs> right, right, right. Is this him? He's like, no. <laughs> That is, that is a good one though. We gotta do that. We gotta find a Jeff now. Javon knows him. Yeah. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> it's real. <laughs> I lie to you not, man. I lie to you not. Like it's real. Hundred percent facts, true stories. We went behind the scenes on this one. Oh shit! Oh man, that was funny as so. hell. Sorry for the spoiler alert. Nah, you're good. Ooh. You know another thing I gotta watch that's on Netflix? It's a documentary. Y'all into documentaries? I'm into docs. Especially I'm into documentaries, documentaries, but I don't know about no fall or no cabals or no shit. He said, I don't know no fall or cabal. It's called, he said, I don't know about fall or cabal. 
Listen, that joint, you got to watch it, bro. I mean, if you want to. But if you don't, I'm not going to force it on you because I know it's, it, it could be very deep. It could be very deep for your head. You know what I mean? Nah, see, like, I don't know. Shit like that, bro. Like, I like tripping and then getting into it. No, no, you don't want to trip with that. You don't want to trip with that. See, bro, I'm not intrigued. I'm not intrigued. I'm not intrigued. You might trip out and be like, they're fucking killing for this. Nah, I'll take like a quarter hit. Shit's at the fan. Literally, they're shit in the fan. I fucked up in the bathroom, mom. You're taking the shit the wrong way. Taking the shit the same thing you need as the toilet. Jesus. Nasty. Nah, but the uh, the it's on Netflix. It's fucking called uh, how to how to get away with drug scandal, I believe. Man. Or or what did me say? Uh, oh yeah, yeah, I was right. How to get away with a drug scandal. It's about mm. like the two Boston girls. It was about the two. It was about the two Boston girls. Guzzler over who here. Were, this um, man showed me the slurp girl from two thousand. <laughs> yeah. That shit was. This man had a liter of water. He now has two shots of it left. Yeah, like <laughs> we're, like, fuck, we're like, fuck this documentary. Wait, give him someone, give him a gallon. This wow. fucking guy drunk that shit with a big ass throat just now and shit. Goop, 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 goop. Terrible. Phenomenal. <laughs> Phenomenal. I watched his jaw on the hinge and him swallow that shit. <laughs> yeah, like, I just heard it, so I can imagine. <laughs> what is <laughs> Throat of life. <laughs> like,. <clears throat> No, nah, but like I said, this this shit is crazy, bro. Like how these these two is these two girls who worked for the um the fucking like they worked for each side of like Boston where at uh how you call that shit a fucking uh like for the FBI like they they basically like helped out with drug criminal cases. informants yeah 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 there you go like the CIs like the is this the pharmacist niggas yeah, on the yeah, yeah. Oh, shine shoes shit. Hey, yo, son, hold on 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 oh, oh you know son, it's getting serious he just switched son, his accent. No. No, 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 this shit. Word. This nigga <laughs> from Irvington. <laughs> Shout out to the bricks. You already know, 973, you heard? <laughs> listen, listen, listen. This nigga, right, this man's a pharmacist, right? No, it's not that one. It's not that one? Nah, it's not a mess. Two girls. There were two girls. Oh, they, they I'm mixing both... it up. I'm mixing it up. I'm thinking the pharmacist one cook, too. Did you see the pharmacist? Nah, I didn't. No, oh, the pharmacist is crazy. You got to watch that shit, bro. It's about this man, right? He's a pharmacist. And his son ODs, he dies on drugs and shit. So the nigga goes crazy, like on some vigilante shit, trying to figure out who the drug dealer was that sold his son the, the drugs and shit and killed his son. So boom, he finds the nigga, right? And the nigga doesn't, like, he, the, the pharmacist doesn't know that he found the nigga. The nigga's basically like, yo, I'm gonna help you find the nigga that killed your son, whoop de whoop, blah, blah. And he's feeding him all this information. Long story short, nigga end up finding out it's bullshit, and the nigga that's fucking telling him this shit the whole time was a boy that killed his son. Mm. So boom, he get locked up. Then he gets into some like some deeper shit. Like, yo, look, I started noticing that all these young boys coming in, my son's age was, you know what I mean, taking the same drugs my son was taking, and they all coming from the same fucking doctor. So the nigga go on a whole vigilante movement against the doctor mm. and get her locked up, and the bitch is fucking sending out thousands of prescriptions, oxycodone, Percocet, Suboxin, all fucking narcotics. That's all she feels. Her fucking doctor's office is open at nighttime from 10 p.m. to fucking 6 o'clock in the morning. What doctor's office you you know opens and runs those hours? Mm, you know what I'm right, saying? That's crazy. She got fiends in the motherfucking lobby, all types of shit. She got motherfucking cops on payroll. The bitch was running like a bichote, like real type shit. And, the, and this old white pharmacist nigga found it all out and broke it all down. Mm. But yeah, about the two bitches. No, I was trying. I was gonna ask you though, like, what, <laughs> was that that's on Netflix? Yeah, it's on Netflix. It's called The Pharmacist. The Pharmacist. Oh, I gotta check that out. It's a documentary. Mm-hmm. Oh, I gotta check that out. It's a docu series because the nigga got deep. He start after that. He started attacking other motherfuckers that were selling pills and all types of shit. Oh, so he just got it, he got it in his he head. He was on Batman mode. That nigga was like, yo, I'm saving everybody from this opioids. Oh, so he just he just got it in his head. He, I'm just going to be the biggest pharmacist out here and shit. Right. <laughs> right. He was trying to take all the competition. <laughs> Gambino Pokemon cards. That is kind of funny and kind of like, cool. Like childish? Yeah, and he's hitting the move. He's got Flower Ooh, Boy. What? Oh, that's the, um, that's what's his name? Uh, this is Tyler the Creator card. Artists, oh, I, yeah, artists on the Pokemon, Pokemon card. Yeah, you got Kanye West right at the college dropout. 
All Falls Down is 90. <laughs> Let me see this shit. That's interesting. You know what's funny, though? So I'm actually thinking about getting back into collecting Pokemon cards. Fuck. Yo. Some of these cards are still fucking worth something, bro. Even bro, today's a lot of cards. these cards are still worth something. Even today's cards, bro. Yo, my son has like six cards that are from 1998, bro. Damn. The, the like first gen? Original, original cards. Original first yeah, gen. He has like three, three Pikachus and like... One's a holographic. I just don't know what it is. I know the cert. Remember, the, remember there was two Pikachu cards back then. I don't the, know. The regular, regular yellow one, regular Degla guy. Someone's got a speaker. And then there was the holo- There was a regular Degla guy, the yellow guy, and then there was the the holographic yellow mm-hmm. with the the sparkles and shit. And then there was the Raichu, that was regular. No, you're you're you're, not, you're missing the one Pikachu, bro. Pikachu one is the there's the regular one where everybody pretty much had this card. But I right, I it's the basic yellow guy. Yeah, but the other one was yellow too. But what it was was that um, it's the one that's close up where he looks chunky. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's like a close up John view, but that John like there's a certain thing about that card that actually it makes it kind of worth more or whatever. That's why I said that's why I'm thinking about getting back into Pokemon cards, bro, because them shits. Some of these cards, bro, like, I be watching some of these dudes really be picking cards, bro, and they be getting mad, bro. Like, they be actually actually getting, like, these shits appraised and everything. It's crazy, bro. I be feeling the same way about Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Same thing? Yeah, Yu-Gi-Oh cards are, are worth I something. Never, I, never, I never got into Yu-Gi-Oh like that. Nah? Yeah, never really been into Yu-Gi-Oh like that. But Pokemon, man, I love that shit. Pokemon, I love Pokemon, dude, too. Would you do it? Would you collect again? <laughs> Pokemon, yeah. I mean, I can see myself doing that again. As a hobby, I can see myself doing that. Yeah, I used to love the games. Most most of all, I used to love the games. Game Boy. <laughs> nah, facts. Uh. You play Pokemon Go. Pokemon Go's where it's at. Yeah, you like, got it. I was. I don't got it in my phone right now. But when this shit first Pokemon. came out, I was going in on that shit, bro. Like, at one point. Me and my boy was just driving around for hours, just Pokemon Go, man. I had time in. <laughs> Fucking random random meetups with people at Cooper River for no, raids facts. and shit. Yeah, facts. You just pull up like, hey, you're here for the raid? Yeah. Like, that shit, shit yeah, was that is, awesome. Uh, that's probably the last time I started pl- I think that was the last time I played Pokemon Go was probably about, I want to say probably about four years ago, I think, bro. So it's been a minute since I played Pokemon Go. Yeah, I haven't played that shit in a while. So the niggas want to get back on it? <laughs> Believe it or not. I mean, if 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 you want to be my friend and actually send me gifts, fuck yeah. As long as we get to go around collecting Pokemon, I'm with it. Yeah, man. It's been a while. Cool, bro. It's that really been a while since I get that cool. since I did that shit. Yeah, man. How do you feel about it? I've never played this shit. Not once. And I obviously don't feel bad about it. I didn't give a fuck about playing Pokemon Go. Niggas used to play on, on their phones like, I'm playing Pokemon Go, man. Yeah, I'm about to go walk to the corner to the gym. Yeah, see, you ain't take it serious. I was taking it serious. I didn't take it serious. I didn't even fucking download the app, bro. One of my boys drove cabs. I used to get off at work and just ride around with him all day in the cab just so I can get fucking <laughs> extra spins. And yo, shit. stop yo, right here. One of those, is, man. Stop right here. Get There's a Charizard. Like, yo, stop right here, bro. <laughs> Nigga, pull out the Pokédex like, hold up, cuz. Here's $10 for guys. Go around the block. Spin the block. Hold on, I died. That nigga killed me. Spin the block. <laughs> yeah, because then you had to stay in the spot, like stand in that spot to right. battle. Or you you had to stand moving. in the spot to fight the yeah, fucking yeah. character and shit, and then catch him. People were dying because of that shit. They were actually like fucking weird ass random spots, like high in the middle. Yeah, because people, because people were hacking or something, or I don't even know. Nah, not just, even, bro. They were set. There were no, glitches. Cause can, no, because you can set spots up. Uh, if I, if I'm correct, I mean you can set you can set pinpoints up. For like a spin or something like that, so mm. it'll attract other Pokemon users to come. Okay, and okay, that's how okay. people were getting like robbed or, I guess, getting into crazy situations. But if you at a gym or something like that, like you have to stay there. You got to be in that area to actually right to like actually fight to, in the gym to play and shit like that. To be in that in that actual league or whatever. That's litty though. That's the only thing that's lit about. And it, you got to have gotta like hella potions and shit if you're getting into a battle. Your Pokemon is weak. Or you doing a raid? Right, that shit like ding, 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 ding. You don't remember the original Pokemon when he was dying? He used to. Yeah, but I don't. I don't think it does that. I don't know if it does that on Pokemon Go. So I don't know. 
You, I don't know if you fuck actually you play it like we play it. <laughs> fuck you, bitch. I don't know. Fucking nerd. Like, don't tell me you play Pokemon Go and you making Game Boy sounds. Ding, ding, ding. I don't know. Bro. I never said I played Pokemon Go, bitch. I told you I never download the shit. Did, 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 didn't did, he just did, say he used to walk no, to the corner and I get didn't. some spins? No, I used to watch the niggas go to the corner and be like, yo, I'm about to go over here to the gym. Uh, uh, uh. Well, we gotta be- we're going to rewind that. We're going to rewind that because he's going to say, yeah, I never really like, took it too serious. I used to just go down Just to remember the 1635. No. 1635. Right. Right. So. Right. We, we got we to record it. Come on, BB. Say that stupid ass shit. Come on, BB. Yo, hey, yo, fuck out of here, dog. Don't be putting up with a fucking alias like that because you already know what it is. Cloudy Swim Team, nigga, meet me. Give a big ass shout out. So, real quick, though. What's your? I, I I don't know. I'm just gonna make it real hard. Number number one Pokemon. What's your favorite Pokemon? Ugh, and why? No, my number one favorite Pokemon. Like, I mean, I got them. I just want to make sure I want to clarify on your question. Like, that one Pokemon and it's all its evolutions, or just this one Pokemon? Just name a favorite Pokemon. Just a Pokemon well, I need to know, know because the, my favorite Pokemon has evolutions, and I like it because of those evolutions. Yeah, you can like them. I mean, you can... Because I like Squirtle. Right. That's, well, uh, you, I mean, you can like him for whatever reason. It don't, it don't matter if it's like he got evolutions or not. It's still that Pokemon. Well, obviously it, we know well, it matters Pokemon because... Evolve. Most, like or at least most of them... Or, or at least most of them evolve. <laughs> You know what I mean? Well, I yeah, most of them, but like I, I, I that's why I, I try to split it because like there are ones like like I like Snorlax. Like that's actually like my second favorite would be Snorlax. Really? Yeah, love Snorlax. Snorlax. Snorlax, I, I, Snorlax I, is a beast. He's a beast. I, I hate Snorlax. It's probably because I always got Snorlax when I was a kid. Oh, bring back bad memories with the right, bullies. I know I said one, right? <laughs> I, I know I said one, but I like like all the fighting type Pokemon like Hitmonchamp, Hitmonlee, right. Primate. Uh, McChamp and shit. Machoke. Machamp, Machoke, uh, Geodude, all the Gravelers, all those earthy rock type. Right. I always like those. You always like those, man. You was Brock. But one of my favorites would have had to been uh, Charizard, like Charmander, that evolution. Yeah, my you favorite. All, my favorite all time Pokemon, or all time favorite Pokemon of all time is definitely Charmander. Just because I just felt like Charmander was that nigga, bro. Like throughout the whole series, like he was the only Pokemon that was just like that episode where he was trying to keep his tail lit. Like yeah, that shit was everything. That shit was crazy. Hiding so. under mushrooms and shit. He was running around. He was in the trenches, bro. Like yo, I gotta stay lit, bro. That nigga was always lit, son. And that's why I fuck with Charmander. And obviously he turns into Charizard, nigga. Word up, son. Big ass dragon. Hard headed. Hardback, nigga. You already know what it is. Man, these pretzels are great, man. These pretzels. Well, I mean, I have a top five. So it's always been Squirtle, Snorlax, Abra, and all you know, all his evolutions. Facts. Abra. Yeah. That's why that's why it's actually I thought it's hard. Drowsy. But all of them niggas. Well, I don't know I, if he, I, I've, I've, I, he was a beast too. I do like Drowsy and, and um the other one, uh, Ghastly Gengar. Right, I like those. And, and what was the other one? It was there was uh, Drowsy and there was a uh, Hypno. Hypno Lee. No, no, no. That's hit. That's Hypno. Yeah, that was the other one. That was the fighting type. Now there was another one like Hypno. Hypno something. Hypnos. It was called Hypno. It was just called Hypno, right? It was yeah. Hypno. I like them too, but like they never was like my top. They were, they were in my top ten, but not my top five. But I like those guys too. But. It always been those. It was been yeah, Squirtle, Snorlax, the, the Abernor's evolutions, um, Mister Mime. Oh, I hated Mister. Nah, Mime. I loved him. Love Mister Mime, bro. I hated that Mister Mime, Mister Mime. And I liked it like uh, Entei. That was like those like pretty much my top fives right there, like Entei. Right, they're legendary. Yeah, and I hate. I'm not a big fan of the fire types. Because I feel like they could easily just get beaten with water. Like, all you got to do is have, you can have a fucking mud kip and you could kill them. As long as they have fucking waterfall or some shit, you know? So, like, for me, like, I, I hate the the fire types because just, it's just easy to beat. 
I'm not saying nothing wrong with y'all picks, but I'm just saying that like that's how I always looked at it. So like, I mean, but, your fucking Mudkip wouldn't kill my Charizard. <laughs> so, yeah. in, the, in the Pokemon real world, no, nah, he, he would definitely get ate up. And even in the Pokemon game, in the sense of, like you know, card game, he would definitely get ate up. But like in the fucking Game Boy game and shit, man, you had a certain water type. I'm gonna name one that I fucked with. Magmar. Magmar was uh, cool. Magmar and Magby. I feel like Magmar was cool. Magmar was cool. And Magby, the little baby right. version. Magby was cute. Little cute little thing. I want a Pokemon now. Imagine that shit though, right? Real Jinx. Life. You remember Fox. Jinx? Ninetales. Like Nine Nine and uh I like Ninetales. And uh the new EV, you, the new. It was called it? Volpix. Volpix, and Vol- then it. Volpix. 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 And then it evolved Volterian. to Ninetales. Voltreon, Voltreon, you mean, I think. Voltreon. Voltreon. Oh, no, no. Jo- it was the three. It was Jotion. Jotion, Voltion. No, no Jotion. That, that was that was Eevee's evolution. The Eevee evolution we, was yeah, Jotion, Vaporeon, and Flameon. Jotion, Vaporeon, and. Flameon. And. And. and uh, Vaporeon, right? It was Jolteon, Vaporeon, and Flameon, I and believe. Flareon. 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 That's what it was. The fire one. I didn't like the fire one. At all, then, though, I think I liked then, the fire and one. Then, <laughs> and then in the later Jolteon. episodes, then they got Espeon. Yeah. And Umbreon. Umbreon, that yeah. That pink one, pinkish purple or whatever, and the oh, black one. I yeah, get your what? shit, bro. Umbreon was my Pokemon, shit. Pokemon, nigga. Yeah, Umbreon was my I shit. I catch them all. I'm still shit. trying to catch them all to this day. Facts. <laughs> Each and every one of them. Yo. Yeah, Umbreon was my shit. I had to admit that. Zapdos, Moltres, Articuno. I love Zapdos. Zapdos was that nigga. Articuno was cool. What was the po- uh Pidgey? Pidgey. I used to fuck with Pidgey too. I like I like I like the evolved Pidgey. Ash yeah, had it. I was about I mean, to say I like the way he evolved and shit. Pidgeot to Pidgeotto. Pidgeotto's that nigga, bro. You can't, you cannot lack with a Pidgeotto, bro. Oh, it's funny because in the games, I'll get them because they're like, you know, you, you grab them first to just build them up until you don't need them no more. But I'm going to be real with you. I've always hated that fucking Pokemon, dog. I feel like I've always hated Pidgeys. I've always hated fucking Ratatats. Sparrow. I've Sparrows. Fucking, Sparrows, especially fucking Weedles. Uh, Farfetch'd. Ew, I hate Weedles. Definitely Weedles. I hate them shits. Uh, what was the other one? Butterfly? The Butterflies? Butterfree. Butterfreeze. Oh, my God. I fucking hated them, too. You might have hate them, but low-key, like in the Game Boy games, I would fuck you up with a Butterfree. Oh, no. Nah, Butterfree Yo, was strong as shit. That's that why was I like hated a grass that motherfucker. fucking poisonous, put you to sleep, right. everything, bro. I hated like, that shit. Bro, in the game, he will fuck you up. You'll be poisoned, sleep, and everything while he beating on you. <laughs> right. This is like... That fucking battle cry was so weak. Was like, <laughs> that sounded like a Star Wars noise. <laughs> Get out of here. Like nah, that's how they fucking, that's how the Star Game Boy Wars. battle cry used to be. They used to be like, <laughs> some weird ass shit like that. Right, right, right. Nah, right. Don't, don't, don't do it, bro. Right. We'll be here for another Star hour. Star Wars and Star Trek. All right, come on, bro. I love Star Trek. I'm getting me started on that. <laughs> here we go with that weak shit. But nah, man, Pokemon was definitely the shit, bro. What was your, what was y'all one of y'all favorite games like the for the Game Boy? Or See, Game I stopped Boy Advance I, or whatever. Y'all I stopped, yeah, on. I stopped around like the Game Boy Advance, but I played up to the new ones like the Pokemon like Shield and shit like that, whatever. I think it is. No, yeah, but shit, the last Pokemon game I remember vividly playing was like Crystal. All right, right. Bro, I, I went up to and playing, Emerald. like, Emerald and Sapphire, Ruby. Right, right, I remember right. when they came out, Sapphire and Ruby and Emerald. I remember when they came out. But like, even even with those, like, I like I like how they changed it up with the newer, like, Emerald and stuff like that. But I still like the originals, like Pokemon Yellow, Leaf Green, like, those original ones. I like those a little bit better. better Just because I like that, that uh, generation of, uh, like, Pokemon. Like, now, the way that shit is, like, they got... I don't know if you like been up to date with that shit, but now they got Pokemon that's like Ultra Beast. I don't know if you heard about that, but now yeah, they got like Pokemon that's like Ultra Beast and Moon like, Sun and that, all that shit, shit went like two Digimon for me. <laughs> I, and I don't know, I, I don't. Now I I I, I, I can still alright, but it's just like I kept up with the shows, so like I know what you're talking about with those drawings. I think they actually make it cooler, in my opinion. They kind of make it kind of cooler. In my opinion, I, I like them. 
But I have to say, my favorite Pokemon game would be Crystal. Crystal. I don't think I ever played that one. You didn't play Crystal? Sure. Yeah. That was a good one. I remember Crystal. I think that was my favorite one. It would be Crystal. I think it was what the other one was Golden Crystal, I believe, at the time. Rest when we was kids, it was Golden Crystal. No, it was Golden Silver. Was it Golden Silver? Yeah. It was Golden Silver. Uh, well, I remember having Crystal, and I loved Crystal. Crystal was fucking great. Crystal was like a third that just ended up coming out after. Hey. <clears throat> yeah, Johnny, come on. What do you gotta say? I really don't know, but I just I love you guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Man, you. Yeah. I got law yo. You know that uh comedian? Well he's like on Instagram, uh Chink Capone. Never heard of that. Never guy. heard of him. He's come he's on. from Lakeshore. You heard of him. Lakeshore and Camden. Like Look, nah, right. I sound like I was yeah, the Poppy Bowl. You nah. never heard of him? I you know, that nigga. Me. Morning, motherfucker. <laughs> Good morning, him. everybody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He be screaming out his windows, but like he's like Instagram famous. No, I, heard of him, I, I, I haven't. Heard I haven't. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, well, I'm not big on that I, stuff. I, I ain't gonna lie to you. Like, I really don't be. be, in the hood? be out here. Yeah, he be in the hood, bro. He be yeah, bro. But anyway, he is square. But um, <laughs> he was at a uh, a party in Miami. That uh, you ever heard of Sauce Walker? Like that. Like, he's verified on Instagram, so I know I never heard of him before that. But he had a party in Miami, and the boy Chink got kicked out for fake flexing. And then the, the boy Sauce Walker like offered to put seventy five to pay someone seventy five hundred to whoop his ass. What? Just seventy five hundred though? Seven thousand five hundred dollars to whoop that nigga ass for him. One that's time. that's that's low, bro. That's but that's low. The nigga not worth it. He just that's a quick come up. Right. You gonna do it then? So, I mean, whoop you for seven five? Hell yeah, that's a quick come up. All I do you is wouldn't outside. do it, Angel? You wouldn't do it? You wouldn't I would do it. I mean, for 75, but I mean, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, like, I would like at least 10. I'm cool with the 75. I'm good with the 75. <laughs> That's a nice whip. Pull the 75 out right now. All right, I'll be right back. But what if you lose? <laughs> what the fuck does it matter? They can get that 75 up. You got to beat him to get the 75. What oh, if I'm you gonna lose? I'm going to beat him. I'm going to whoop ass. I'm going to fucking grab everything. I'm going <laughs> to crack him over the head. <laughs> Nigga, listen, I'm going to be fighting dirty as fuck. He gonna be fucked oh, up. Oh, apparently he was wearing the dude's clothes, wearing his shoes, telling the someone joins it was his crib and shit. Oh shit. Like, he oh, was fake flexing. Fake, fake, fake flexing hard. It just sounds like two Instagram niggas just beefing. Maybe, but <laughs> that's yeah, how but petty the other it nigga is. put a big flex on him. It was like, yeah, put seven five seven five on his head and then go fuck him up. That's a big flex right there. For, but what if for all right, so what what niggas. what if you do it and then the dude don't even have the bread for you? Bro, he got Then I'm going to fuck him up. You for, believe for that, though? Bro, you're not going to make a video like that. I if mean, Bull tell me, y'all, I'm going to give you 7-5 for fucking him up, and then I go fuck Bull up, and then I go back for my money, and Bull don't got my money, I'm fucking Bull up for making me look like Booboo the Fool now. But not, not, It only makes sense. I mean, yeah, but you have to, because now you, you just put yourself in shit that you don't even need to be in. Right, exactly. For money. Right, so now I got to fuck Bull up, because he made me look like <laughs> Booboo the Fool. <laughs> Yeah, that's terrible. What about you, JQ? JQ was fucking bull up for the 7-5. He's shaking his head, but he's going to fuck... He's going to go fuck bull up for that 7-5. Listen, if his boss be like... If Damon be like, hey, yo, aloha, I got this 7-5 for you. Go outside the bar and go fuck bull up. But make sure you take your shirt off so they don't know you're working. <laughs> he's Say. going right outside and he's going to go fuck bull up real quick. <laughs> this nigga, he's going to be pounding Pounding on boy real fast like he a pineapple nigga. <laughs> What's crazy though is just like that's how, that that's how quick though right. You <laughs> gotta think about that. That's how quick someone could lose their life. Yeah, that's sad. That's how quick like you know what I mean over over because I mean like not saying like the dude's gonna he's just saying someone to kill him but right 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 you right. never know. But that's how like shit can happen. Shit can happen know. right. And then it makes you think though like damn now the whole situation started because he was mad because he flaked flex because he had his clothes and all that shit like. Javon, you know how many times I let you fake flex? And you let me fake flex? <laughs> all the time, nigga. Like, we see each other clothes all the time. <laughs> nigga, we should be beating each other up by now. Like, right, you feel nigga, me? look. That's what I'm saying. So, like, it's like, I yeah, know like, I bag bitches because I had this nigga shirt on once. <laughs> like, I mean, so it's like, and that's just being honest, you feel me? But that's what I'm saying. That's how petty it is. Like, That's what I said. Like, yeah, I would do it. But at the same time, like, 
I'm going to do it for something that's not even my beef. You better at least give me 10, bro. I'm sorry. <laughs> that shit better be worth it, huh? I want an even number, my nigga. I want 10 racks. I can, I can respect it. I, can respect I mean, that's it. how I look at it. It's not my beef. Yeah, because at the end of the day, what's another two and a half, bro? If you're going to give me the seven, if you really you might, care if you that much. Give me seven, five, you might as well give me the other two and a half yeah. and make it an even 10. If you, don't, if you care that much, might as well. And you balling like that, might as well. Yeah, fuck it. And y'all ain't, you don't even got to come to me. I don't got to come to you. Cash app, nigga. <laughs> Word. The for fuck? that thing you did. <laughs> yeah, you feel me? Just put up there for that thing you did. That's it. You know what I mean? That, I, don't know, I just look at everything more differently. You feel me? Like I, I like that's like the other day, bro. I really, I really sat here when, like, and I was thinking to myself, like, like you ever just, like, ever just really just get up, bro, and really just want to do something different. Like, like just change everything. Like you just like from the way you fucking like feel look at life everything like you just really want to actually just do fucking good yeah you know what Almost i mean every like, fucking day i get up like like this. you just want to just do straight good you don't want to do nothing stupid no bad no drinking nothing like you just want to just just fucking just do everything possibly good even if it means fucking going through an extra stupid mile or whatever you may look at as stupid or mile you know extra mile of feeding the hunger or doing some other shit you right, know what right, i mean right. whatever you know what i mean like that's how I be looking at it, bro. To the point where, like, like I want to, like, I don't know. I guess I'm trying to get to the point. Like, sometimes I guess you just you want to be able to be a blessing for others, right? And you know, maybe that I guess, yeah, but more because I want to do more. You know what I mean? You ever right. just felt like you just want to just do more? Right, right, right. I definitely have felt like that. And I don't know. I just look at it like I just look at shit like I don't know, I've been thinking about a lot of shit lately. Just like you just I don't know, looking at things like I just want to start a clean slate. You know what I mean? Just like want to do shit differently. Right. Want to feel differently. Like the things I would normally don't do, I want to do. Yeah, that makes sense. You know? Because after a while, I feel like, you know, as human beings, we get tired of doing the same shit. And that's what falls into the fat. We fall into a pattern that's we call comfortableness, but really, we're not really comfortable. Right. At the end of the day, as humans, we're really nomadic people. If you look at it right, if you look at all the history and shit, nobody's ever really stayed in one place for, you know what I mean? for uh, forever eventually they pick up and they move and they go somewhere else and you know what i mean shit changes so looking at life that way is like all right we are not supposed to stay at the same state that we're in at this moment eventually we're going to change you know what i'm saying so that's just how i look at it bro like eventually you're going to get tired of doing what you're doing and living the way you're living and doing what you're doing and you're going you're going to do something about it mm -hmm. and if you don't that's good too, cause at the end of the day, just live your life. You feel me? Like none of that shit really matters how people feel and how people portray a certain shit. Like that shit is neither here nor there. But why is that though? Because it's all a matter of perception. At the end of the day, like you may see something one way, I may see something another way, and somebody might agree with me, but not with, but not with you. Right, right, and then you might have another person that might agree with you and not with me. Right, but that's how it should be, though. Right. So at the end of the day, it's like it, it doesn't matter. You just got to find the balance in between all that shit. Because you're going to have people that you that disagree with shit. You know what I mean? You're going to disagree with shit. It's all about finding the balance in between all of that. Right, right. But, like, see, I'm talking more, not really more in a balance statement, more just in them just, like, what if the shit we do every day that we are so used to doing, we think it's so good to do? But it's not good to do. Well, what if we tons of shit? Right. What like what if there's like what if we if what if there's actually one thing that we can change right and that one thing actually was the whole reason why we can't be better or even ascend to the next level in your in your talent or I get you. You know what I mean? Like. Like the, the the thing that you do that you like doing the most is what's hindering you from actually right. You know what I mean, leveling like up. what if you know? I mean, essentially, that's probably what it is. Could be right. That's probably what it is. It's it's probably exactly what it is. You probably hit the fucking the head on the nail or the nail on the head, rather. <laughs> but we're never really going to know until we start taking them things out and subtracting them and seeing what difference they make in our lives. See, I think I think the thing is for me, I think we do know. And I think I think we know, but the hardest thing for us as human is, is to, to accept it. Is to accept it. 
Yeah, that's a that's a possible theory too. Because there's things we hear we don't want to hear, we'll hear it. And you're gonna either turn it down or you're actually gonna pay attention to it and tell yourself, fuck. You know, that's exactly what I thought. <laughs> you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Like you're gonna look in the mirror or tell yourself later, like shit, that's that's exactly how I felt or thought. And or you're gonna turn it down and be like, fuck off, whatever, whatever, and then you just now stuck and stagnant, you know what I mean, in the same situation feeling you're feeling. Right. So that's I don't know. You got any words on it, John? Johnny? Well, I guess, Johnny stoned out his fucking Well, mind, I guess we're right? going to leave it at that, then. We're going to cut it short on that part. Bow, 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 bow. Yeah, we'll leave with that thought, and I guess for next time we'll come pick up from there, I guess. Boats and hoes. Boats and hoes. Chicka, chicka, chicka. Uh, boats and hoes. you terrible with that. <laughs> but all right, everybody. Have a good night. Everybody with their sign out. Damn, dude, where the fuck you find this at? <laughs> Peace. How can I forget you, girl? I miss you in the worst way. Used to have me feeling like a kid on his birthday. How you let me down, you did it in the worst way. I let you take my heart when you had a family. Fighting for what's right is like.